in the Volta Regional Capital, Ho, MNB Seeds works to add to the food value chain through the production of high-yielding seeds. Knowledge on how to handle hybrid seeds was limited, and the farmers from whom MNB Seeds sources their seeds were deficient in the know-how. The specific challenge was that the farmers were still taking things for granted. Just like they do their normal thing. I'll give you an example. Like our maize production, when we say hybrid, we have a female line and a male line. And you have to detach all the, the female lines. Previously, the farmers will wait and let the female cross itself before they will go and deceive us that they are uh, detasseling. MNB seeds were introduced to the Skills Development Fund and they went through the application process. The fund we got from uh, SDF, we used it to train our farmers. After the training of the farmers was to improve upon one of the structures. That's the solar dryer on my right. Initially it was just on the floor, but now we've raised a platform and put in fans and have changed the sheet to fiber. So the heat in the room is higher. So for that, for what, that one ton, we only dry within two or three days, and it's dried. The quality of the seed has improved. Previously, in 2010, 2011, people call our hybrid local hybrids. But as I'm speaking now, people will want MMB seeds. It has in, increased farmers' productivity from one ton per hectare to four, 4.5 tons per hectare. Millicent is a farmer that works to sort seeds with a company. The training on recognizing and handling hybrid seeds was an eye-opener for her. SDA fund, I'll say, is a, I don't know what word to use, but it's a savior and it came at the right time. And if we have the opportunity to get more, we'll train more and train the other aspect of it. The SDF Fund Phase 2 was funded by the Government of Ghana and the Government of Denmark as part of its commitment to private sector development. 